All aboard the Tech Force train, all aboard. Thank you. Yes, this is a first class ticket. Here you go. Have a seat. We'll be departing soon. Final calls for the Tech Force train. All aboard. Here we go. Toot -toot. We've got five great products to take a look at this week, and we're kicking it off with the EXSA, or also known as EXA E900 Pro headset. First off, let me tell you right off the bat, it is great value for money. In the UK, a gaming headset with quality virtual surround sound and a noise cancelling mic on offer, the E900 Pro usually costs around $60. If you want a headset with multi-platform capabilities that can be used on pretty much anything, I'm talking about your PC, your Switch, your PS4, your Xbox One, your smartphone and your tablet, you get the idea. This thing is user-friendly. The E900 Pro aids multi-platform uses with swappable USB and a 3.5mm audio cable. The mic quality is good. The noise cancelling and the ability to detach the mic is also very appealing. I like having options and this is a good option. Considering the cost of the E900 Pro, having a good mic with noise cancelling capabilities is a major win. Cha-ching, a major win for us. Now, something that could have been thought out just a little bit better would have been making these foldable. Unfortunately, even though it's got a bag, they're not foldable and the E900 would be more convenient for travel and it would take up a lot less space in your bag or your pocket if they were foldable. This seems to be a bit of an oversight with the E900 Pro considering the headphone appeal. And then, unfortunately, no RGB lighting effect here. You won't find any color cycling or any cool lighting effects here. It's just one steady, unblinking, sinister red light that's um, always on, always watching, which matches the color scheme, but might not be what the RGB lovers are looking for. Then it's also not wireless. If you've given up on wide peripherals, you will be less likely to be buying this because those wide ones are just a little bit cheaper. The hands-free ones are a little bit more expensive. Wireless headsets are preferable as they are a lot less restrictive, which is important. If you get up and walk away, you don't drag your entire console along with you. My final thoughts on the EXA E900 Pro 7.1 Virtual Surround Sound 2.1 gaming headset is it's a budget headset that doesn't skimp on quality. The detachable mic has voice cancelling and its design works well for the use as headphones as well. It's also multi-platform, making it perfect for PC, console and smartphone gamers. And you know what that means. A winner, winner, a chicken dinner. Moving swiftly along to the EXA E900, the gaming headset. What stands out here immediately is the build quality, the materials, and mmm, so comfortable on my ears. Yes, if you've got headphones that spend hours and hours on your ears, they need to be comfortable. Then also, the audio quality is mwah, chef's kiss. It's excellent. Microphone quality also great because what's the point of having a microphone if my members in my squad can't hear what I'm saying? The price ranges between 20 to 40 pounds and that retails in the UK and it is great quality. Now, one little thing you might want to take note of is that the microphone connector has a non-standard plug. And that means in a moment of rage, if you take off those headphones and smash them down onto your keyboard and break them, it's going to be very difficult to replace and also very expensive to replace because this connector is um, you know, quite unique. Then there's the sound leakage and the echo. The people around you will suffer from uh, secondhand listening, which isn't as bad as secondhand smoke, yet still quite irritating to those around you if you play your music at a moderate or loud volume. I had to turn my music down quite a lot before the people around me 
couldn't hear it. So yes, quite a little bit of sound leakage. Mm -hmm. This is an incredibly priced gaming headset with a familiar and comfortable design. The materials feel much more chiching expensive than the price tag suggests. The sound quality is excellent and the microphone quality is also just as good. Yes, excellent. The EXA E900 Gaming is a great product and will always end up being one of your MVPs when you play. Let's get a little wireless now and we're looking at the EXA E900 Bluetooth Wireless Gaming Headset. First off, <laughs> you're gonna love this one, 50 hours of battery life. Yes, impressive 50 hours of uninterrupted battery life with a USB-C fast charging feature as well. You will be enjoying music throughout the day or indulge in those extended gaming sessions on just one charge. You're never gonna run out of power. Now, it also comes with a 7.1 surround sound technology, enhancing those subtle details in your game so you don't miss a step or a shot. Yes, moreover, these headphones support the convenience of one key switching between three sound modes. Those modes are music, game and movie. One button switches between these three modes, allowing for seamless transmissions depending on the scene. When it comes to connectivity options, well, we're spoiled for choice. There's the PS4, the PS5, the PC and the Switch. And because of the Bluetooth 5.0 compatibility, this means that you can also use them on your mobiles, your laptops, and those Mac devices. The only downer is the price point, and that price point is around 92, oh yes, 120 pounds. An upgrade from wireless version shouldn't increase the price this much. Come on, dude, cut us some slack. Yes, the Ixa E900 Bluetooth wireless gaming headset may seem good for 90 pounds, however, it's not perfect. The sound quality is decent for this price point with the classic boom boom heavy bass soundscape that most budget headsets have but the mids and the highs are a little tingy and they even sound a little bit cheap comfort wise the headset is reasonable but not uh, it's unremarkable yes the clamping force is on point and the weight is ideal for those long use sessions but the unbreathable ear cups become a problem after a few hours of use in my experience the price increase isn't a massive upgrade from the other two pairs of, from exa so um if you have to be wireless then you get these the other two are rocking at those price points let's take a look at some earbuds now and these are the tozo t10 earbuds what i'm loving is that they're waterproof what i'm also loving is their price yes they're pretty cheap but and there is a little bit of a but there is a bad control scheme with limited music control options unfortunately they don't have a companion app to adjust the sound profile or make the changes to their bad controls just a little bit better then there's also the three and a half hour battery life is a little shorter than other true wireless headphones although the case does provide up to four extra charges then on the bright side their charging case supports wireless charging which which is very rare for headphones at this price point. Okay, so let's break it down. The Tozo T10s are good headphones for taking to the gym. Their heavy bass, bass, bass. The heavy bass sound profile will keep you amped, amped, amped. Will keep you pumped up at the gym. And they're surprisingly stable even without those stability fins. Their truly wireless design means you don't have to worry about any cables getting in your way. And they're rated at an IPX8 for full waterproofing. They're a little bit uncomfortable and, you know, those buttons, they're difficult to press. And this may mean that when you're trying to push the darn buttons, you get, they get shoved deeper in your ear when you press them. So that's the only little irritating thing is that you might be shoving them deeper into your ear. But otherwise, pretty good. On to our last product of the day, and it's the Uperfect 4K portable monitor. Uperfect have delivered a, well, perfect monitor for us. One always needs an extra monitor, especially if you travel 
traveling with a small laptop, then an additional monitor makes your workflow and working so much easier. Okay, so what's in the box? Here we go. You get your regular paperwork. We know about this. Then we also get two USB-C cables. Uh, that's USB-C to USB-C. So we get two of those. Then you get a full-size HDMI cable and that's HDMI to HDMI. The cable length is good. And this is good because one often needs a little bit extra length just to get from one device to another. Then we also get the charging brick. What I am loving about this product is the case. The case is made of such great build material and I know it's going to last for a long, long time. It also doubles as a stand and it gives me around two or three various positions in which to position the monitor. Yes, it does come with speakers, but you're not going to be using these speakers to get the party started. These speakers will be perfect just to listen to a little video or an audio message that's been sent to you. Taking a look along the side here, we have got loads of ports. We've got an HDMI, a mini DP at 35 mil, millimeter jack that's for your audio, and then a USB-C jack on the side. The menu system is simple, but it's also difficult to navigate because, well, I don't know how these buttons work. But after a little bit of trial and error, you'll get it sorted. Whether you're a gamer, a traveler, or a graphic designer, owning a portable display can add an entirely another dimension to your work and your play. It boasts an insane contrast and weighs a measly little 940 grams. Yes, it's really been on a strict diet. Being an OLED monitor means that they're taking care of your eyes as well because you can now look at this monitor for a lot longer without causing any fatigue due to radiation and blue light. With an insane one millisecond response time and a very acceptable 60 hertz refresh rate, this OLED gaming monitor can display blur free animations and fast fast motion content, which can make you experience ultra high speed video and gaming content smoothly. It also has two settings for operation and that is in the vertical demo mode and in the horizontal demo mode. So if you put it into vertical, this is great for viewing documents, books or websites, games or even apps and more. In horizontal mode, this is great for your PPT, your Excel, your Word, your games, your movies, your TV, etc etc so you've got two settings here i'm sure you'll find one which will please you and exactly how long will you be able to use this monitor before you need to recharge it well the running time is between three and four hours then you're gonna have to charge it this is a monitor that each and every one of us can enjoy and i think it's a little bit more powerful than we actually can imagine. Think about the weight, 940 grams. And then it's ultra, ultra slim. It's 6.8 millimeters. What an amazing thin design. One also gets the foldable case and it is a 10 point touchscreen as well. Then you've got the USB-C connections, the mini HDMI connections, and it is really a brilliant 4K monitor. In an imperfect world, Uperfect brings us a monitor that is, well, pretty much perfect. That's all we've got time for. Catch you in the next one. See you. Bye bye. We've lost one of the great voices being James Earl Jones in the past week or so. Let's just take a moment to remember him and a few of his great sayings. My favorites were. Remember who you are, and everything the light touches is our kingdom. Oh, all classics, all classics. Thank you so much, Mr. James Earl Jones, for your iconic voices. We will always remember who you were.